The moving walkway exit has just approached. Can you guess where we are at? That's right, we're in the queue line for It's a Small World and we're going to have a great time. I am so excited. Well, obviously we're really not, in, like, I know, stupid joke, but I was really debating on renewing my annual pass, but I ended up doing it today. Yay, we did it. We got a whole nother year. We are here to do Halloween Horror Nights days of two houses. I'm really excited and I want to see the skeleton bar and I want to see the horror thing, but it looks like it is a little bit crazy in here. Oh dear. I have not been here at all for like any Halloween things, unfortunately. It's really upsetting to me. Usually I'm like here first day and all that, but I didn't do that this time. Let's look at some snackies. Snackies. We're gonna cut through the gift shop because it's so nice and cool. Oh no, I don't like that. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, isn't that so scary? That's frightening. I didn't see what the name of this haunted attraction is. I just grabbed my thing, went into the express lane, and I forgot to check. But I will let you know because I obviously I'll figure it out when I'm like going through. The queue line was actually only five minutes long. But I mean, I don't know, you got it, you just gotta do it, right? Like you gotta flaunt it, right? Like you got an annual pass, you might as well do it. Oh no! Everybody coming out sounds like they're super excited and happy. So I I can't even guess because I don't really know what they're all saying. And this is where I have to leave you and I'll let you know what we're doing when I get out. That was great actually. I really liked it. That was definitely the Bride of Frankenstein one. It was really, really good. It was spooky and you know, they're like all behind glass, but I did scream one time because of a cast member. I don't know which one's better, Jimmy Fallon or Fast and the Furious. All right, this is our second and obviously our last house. I'm pretty glad that we have Express Pass. Yeah, this one's just a little bit longer than the last one, that's for sure. Here's the train. That, I, I took my, I, I took my time and I looked at all the details and I looked all of them in the eyes directly and I showed how brave I was. Actually, I didn't look up at all. But I'm sure you already know this because it's called the Tooth Fairy. It's about a little boy who lost his tooth and he swallowed it. So the Tooth Fairy comes in and he wants to get the tooth out of the inside. Oh yeah, I'm looking a little rough because we just got off the mummy and it was great. It had a lot of fun. It's like a haunted house roller coaster. I always say that when I ride it, but it really is. And it was even better this time because it was set to like extreme, crazy, crazy fast right now. Now I have to make a decision and I think my decision is going to be to go to the skeleton bar. Obviously I'm going to pick that over going to the prop shop because I do want to see Harry Potter and everything. And yeah, that's what we're going to do right now. Can you see that rainbow? Oh! Now I was a little unsure of actually where this was, but I knew it was in this kind of area. There it is, it's got the pumpkins. See the like, Cafe La Bamba skeleton bar. Ooh, it smells like eggs right here. Really bad. I've seen this on a lot of people's vlogs and it looks really fun to walk through. Okay, we, we really got their posters up. They got a skeleton in here. Okay, this is like the spooky walk through. Oh, 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 oh. And um, that was that was that. It looks really spooky in person, and on camera, it looks even spookier. So don't get tricked. We're going to go and sniff some ET right now. I can smell it already. It kind of smells like a pool store. Look at it happening again. Universal's taking Disney things and making it into their own. The lights just came on in here because the alien was detecting here. Take a look at it with the lights on. You can actually see everything. Look, you can see the astronauts up there. You can see the jungle bridge up there. This is so exciting to me. I've never seen it with the lights on, so it's like, yeah, it's so cool. We cannot see E.T. because he's around this bend here. But look at how cool. 
Well, we, we've decided to give up on that. We're going to abort that mission, and we have to get to Harry Potter, because I only have one hour left, and I feel like that's a little bit more important than this. Look, everybody, Dr. Lipschitz is coming out of the bush. There he goes. This is like my least favorite part of all of Universal. I, I, no offense to anyone that likes it. I get it, we all like different things. Just not for me. Wouldn't go out of my way for it. Right back there, we got lard. And I never realized this, but I was watching a documentary the other day on the World's Fair, and those are actually from the World's Fair. Isn't that great? I remember the first time I rode this, that was terrifying too. But look, the 1964-65 World's Fair that Walt Disney was at. I'm sweating like the Dickens right now, but we're almost in there, and that's really great because I need a wand. Okay, let's go. Oh, here we go. We just got off of Gringotts. It was great, except it's hard with the 3D glasses and the mask. So I kind of was like, like taking them off. You know, like I can't see anything. Not the mask. I follow the rules. Now I've given Butterbeer a try before, but today we're gonna give it another try because the last time that I tried it, I did not like it at all. All right, we're, we're booking it out of here. We're gonna get on the Hogwarts Express because the line for Butterbeer here is intense. So I'd rather be at Islands because it's open for an extra hour after here closes. So let's, let's, we'll do that now. A lot of the wait times here are pretty high today. Even the Hogwarts Express right now is over 60 minutes. And um, to do Gringotts, which we just got off that, the wait was like 95 minutes and it was only like five that the Express pass. Ooh, this, this is already stopping. We didn't make it far. I speak too soon. And I get this attitude where I'm like, oh yeah, I know what I'm doing. And then all of a sudden, bam, stop. This has definitely been the longest wait of the day so far. We've been applying for Hogwarts Express for like 45 minutes. Oh no, not Hedwig. We are just getting to the part where we divide ourselves into cabins. Woohoo! I'm backing up, backing up, backing up, backing up. My daddy taught me good. Back in it. Never say platform nine and three fourths. Harry Potter fans hate it. We got the entire cabin to ourselves. Hi guys. Do you know the mentors on the Hogwarts oh, Express? The mentors on the Hogwarts Express. Fresh fish. Well, that only took like four hours, but we're finally here. We're in Hogsmeade, and now we're going to get a butterbeer, and I'm going to get a wand. We're here! The butterbeer here is closed, so the only one open is this one down here, and the line is so long. And the line to even get in and get a wand is so long. Okay, my second time trying. It tastes like a Werther's. He's a candy. I bought, I bought, a, I picked a wand, but then I got up here and saw this wand, and I'm like, I need this one instead. I have to show you guys. Look at that. Isn't that special? Boy, I'm not doing so good. Now, the butterbeer, it was okay. It, it still wasn't anything that I get too excited about. I would definitely choose the frozen apple juice from Magic Kingdom before I picked that. But I tried it again, and I like the topping. That was so much fun. And we got the wand with us. We didn't ride with it, but... And I forgot how fun that actually was. Like you go upside down and the Dementors come and they, they suck your soul. All this stuff happens. Avada Kedavra. Well, it is now the end of the day. It's actually 5.51. And I think we kind of got a lot done. I think we did. We did the haunted houses, the skeleton bar. We had butterbeer. We rode Harry Potter, rode the mummy. Got a new fancy wand. That's important. You know what my favorite juice is? Moose Goose Juice Juice. Okay. Let's do it. Woohoo! We made it! Oh, I acted like it was like down to the second. 
that was even better than I remember. It was even better than the last time because it changed this time. Nothing changed about it, that's, that's okay. I know a lot of people have already shown this, but the Velociraptor coaster is coming in. I had so much fun today. Oh, I just ended up in the line for cowfish. That is not where we're going. Here's like the worst part of the day when you don't remember where you parked your car. I know it's here. So I know, I, I mean obviously I parked it somewhere here to get out and walk. That is gorgeous.